All right, so actually I'm gonna go bang out like some fire making real quick. You know, probably just get 60 fire making or something for the points. So uh, before I start though, I wanna get a house because once I get a house, I can uh, get some construction experience. Easy, okay, it's actually pretty uh, safe to get to raid. So you're wondering, what the hell am I doing here? Way too early for solo raiding, but uh, yeah, I'm trying to train my fire making and woodcutting at raids. I'm gonna find a, a raid layout that has ice demon. Yo, am I still woodcutting? Oh, what the fuck? Yo, I just wanted to take a piss. And I'm just back here with 12 woodcutting, dude. Oh my god. Imagine. What the hell, dude? <laughs> ah, lovely. Lovely. Yo, look at this shit, bro. 100k woodcutting XP an hour. Alright, so you get the same XP with just one killing. So, all I gotta do is do a... One kindling at a time method, pretty much. Just drop a whole inventory and light. And that way, I don't think this boss will ever die. And I'll still get a crazy amount of fire making XP, so. Oh, I completed a 250 total uh, task. Let me see how much points I get for that. Yo, nice. I just gained 90. Alright, we got 50 fire making, so that means I'm qualified to go and do some winter top. But before I go... I'm gonna get 60 woodcutting here actually uh, because I can just grab a steel axe really really quick from the woodcutting guild since uh, that's gonna make the you know winter tot a lot faster and uh, 60 is good because I can unlock more more task points so yeah let's just stay here for 60 oh yeah there it is 60 woodcutting hell yeah dude I have access to the woodcutting guild now so I'm trying to get a better axe at the woodcutting guild, but I need 75% favor. So I just went from 20 to 45 with 250 saltpeter, and I'm gonna do the 30% remainder at the mess hall. What the hell? There was a fruit stall here this whole time. What the hell, man? You, you mean to tell me I could have been stealing from this place? All right, we are at 73%. Okay, we're actually done for real. 75%. I'm pretty sure 78%. Hell yeah. Okay, we can finally enter the woodcutting guild, and that's another task done. Woohoo, baby! Yeah, let's go. 160 points for that one. That was nice. The steel axe onwards, they are the same exact effectiveness, so I'm gonna save myself some money then, and uh, just get a steel axe for now, so. So, with the endurance perk at low HP, you're actually able to regen all the damage that you take from Winter Todd. So at 10 HP, it's like pretty much guaranteed since the 4x uh, recovery rate is disgusting. So yeah, this is even more AFK than like the usual Winter Todd that you do. Hey, 75 fire making. I can, now can cut the magic logs and I'm still going, man. I've only done freaking uh, 13 games. Wow, I've gained 25 fire maker levels. <laughs> Yo, 80 fire making. Wait, that's a league task? Oh hell yeah, that's right. It's every 20 uh every 20 intervals, so holy shit. Hey, it's worth it, man. My first tier level 80 uh reward. So I don't actually plan on getting 99 fire making. I might do that in the future, but I just wanted to get as much as I could get tonight because I just wanted to AFK as I'm tired. And it was worth it because I got so many levels. A mil XP an hour fire making and also got some fletching levels as you can see, some construction levels too. And of course all of this contributes to helping me unlock my third relic, so that's awesome. Oh shit dude, oh man I wasn't uh, recording because I thought I was done for the day but um, yeah I was addicted, I want to play more. So I got 20% uh, Shazi in favor, you know, healing the medics. And yeah, that means I could uh, buy some weapons from the shop. This is like the you know place to be if you want to get ready to train your melee. And uh, I was able to actually yoink a adamant sword, dude. This this stuff is like sold out all the time, but it does restock every like 10, 15 minutes though. So you know it's not too bad if you wait it out. But yeah, I got an iron skim. I'm gonna use this, I guess, all the way to 30 attack or something. You know, it'd be really fast. And then I will main the adamant sword after that and. 
I'm gonna go for the rune scheme guitar tomorrow, so I should be able to hopefully get that tomorrow. Yes, there we go. 40. All I need now is 100 more points. Before I start any combat training today, I'm gonna unlock the third tier, and it's gonna be the way of the warrior because I can get 10 times XP once I unlock it. So yeah, it would be in my best interest to do that. I'm really close, 100 points off. So my plan is I'm gonna get 40 fishing. That should give me enough points if I also combo that with the Piscalarius, Queen of Thieves. Yeah, if I do this one, I will get the rest of the points. Oh, so glad I have a uh, 17k GP because I need to spend 9,000 GP on planks so that I can uh, work on the Piscalarius favor. Can't even do the quest. Oh, 40 crafting, easy. All right, so that's another uh, that's another points claim right there. 50 more to go. All right, there we go. Completed the uh, Queen of Thieves. Oh yeah, this is really nice, but uh, I can't use this teleport yet because I don't have the runes for it, but soon I will. This quest was worth the pit stop because now I can actually get the Barbarian Fishing Rod from the store down here. Because I plan on doing a ton of AFK fishing tonight at Barbarian Fishing and also gaining some agility levels. Those are really important for some extra relic points. Finally, after all the uh, distractions and diversions, I've done it. 40 fishing, catch lobsters, and that means reaching the relic tier 3. Hell yeah, bro. I was thinking of artisan uh, because I want to make the herbler stuff grind a lot easier in the future. But honestly, I want to go for that one solo rate completion super early, you know, before I start trying to do like more efficient ones. So it's going to be the way of the warrior for sure. I just want all my combat training to go ridiculously, ridiculously fast. So this is going to be 10x speed, 10x XP on any combat. So yeah, now we can finally train some combat. I'm going to start with magic first. We're going to hit up the RCS library uh, method for that. All right, anyways, I got a 30 something. Crates? I think it's about time we open this. You know, I kind of do need supplies right now. GP I need. Seeds I need. So, let's go. Let's open these up. Heaven Toes. Mahoganies. Ooh, Pyromancer Gab. Hey, nice. Oh, well, I can't do much with it by itself. But uh, this will be good for, I guess, uh, 99 fire making grind eventually that I'll be doing. Oh, man. I am rich though, bro. Nice. 30-something Wintertar Crates. Got me 50,000 GP, so I am pretty much a millionaire in this game. Okay, so I'm gonna try to get 60 magic at the Arceus library. It should be pretty easy though, considering, you know, I have the 10x XP perk. Let's find this teleport incantation. Oh, oh, this one's good. This one's really good. Because if I read it, I will unlock the ability to teleport a Karen with 69 magic, so yeah. Alright, I can't wait to see what my magic level is actually by the end of this. Oh my god. What the hell did I just get to? 45? Oh man, nice. I've been doing the uh, library for about an hour. 57 magic already. We're at 200k an hour, so three more levels to go. And uh, I think that'll be a good stopping point. I've already exceeded the favor, you know, quite a while ago. Okay, is this gonna be enough to get me to 60? Yes, I believe so. Oh, yes, that's awesome, man. Hell yeah. Cool, our first combat skill achieved. Damn, I'm already at 32 combat, even though I have one of everything. That's so weird. I've never actually built an account like this ever. Such a weird thing, but... Let's uh, claim some points, though, you know? I got, like, a bunch of tasks completed. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, thank God the Serex Talisman is, like, a decent ways away. From Konar, because uh, I can't even go to Konar until I uh, unlock the Battlefront teleport, which I did, but I don't have runes for it, so. We finally made it, dude. Mama Konar, I've come. Give me your first task. I get to choose. Okay, so I have the uh, ability to choose, right? Oh, there we go. Alright, so I get to decide what I want. Uh, Well, I am just one stat, so I'm going to definitely do cows for now, because... Oh, my task is done. That was easy. Okay, first task completed. Uh, the results, 10 prayer, 25 strength, 18 hit points, 9 slayer, dude. Okay, let me see if I can get some nice leg wear or hat wear or something. 
Yay! The leather hose and shorts. Oh my god, I look like a unit. <laughs> uh, I'm the ultimate Chad. Yes. Alright, second task. What are, we, what are we gonna get? I'm gonna go for Sandcraft. I've been told Sandcrafts are actually pretty easy. Uh, my stats with Endurance. I'm gonna go and buy myself some armor for Slayer. The anti dragon shield, I don't think I can find any better shield for cheap. So that's a pretty easy, you know, defensive uh, boost. Yeah, I'm not really regening fast enough. Oh, Iron Pickaxe. Oh, that's an upgrade, boys. Let's go. I haven't done any mining yet, so... There we go. 30 attack. Alright, I'm gonna take a little break and uh, grab my new weapon, the Addy Sword. How much power difference are we packing here? Nani? Whoa, 15. Nice, dude. That's like 4 damage more, dude. This is it. 30 defense. Hell yeah. Now I'm gonna go for 40 uh, on attack and strength. And now we can upgrade. Uh, I'm gonna miss the orange, bro. I was I was really rocking it though, you know. Ooh, but now we're looking a little bit more modest, you know. Yeah, nice. I can actually maybe try to tackle some hill giants for the next task. We can see how that goes. All right, guys. We've done all the challenges except for one, and that is the hill giants. So we will tackle hill giants for now. They can drop me some law runes too. Damn, sixty of them, and also I can trade my prayer. Alright, I need to upgrade my gear though, for real. I'm, I'm not ready for these guys with, with this gear. Like, what is this, you know? Alright, this is gonna cost a lot of money, but for the sake of trying to get 43 prayer as fast as I can, I, I'm willing to spend some dollars. Yeah, I'll buy 20 for now. I think 20 insult heads, you know, that'll take a long time to use up, so. Oh, nature runes, let's go. Hell yeah, man. You can't buy nature runes, so I need the nature runes from these guys themselves. Oh, my first insult head. Let's go. Hell yeah. Alright, let's do this. Honestly, didn't know you can actually uh, reanimate heads as you get it. But I do know now, so. Alright, guys. This is going to be the fattest for XP of my life. Oh my god. 6,000. Holy shit, dude. Okay, I'm ready. Yo, I'm going to get 43 so fast, dude. And I don't even have the prayer perk. Oh my god. Damn, another 6,500. 33 prayer. Holy crap, unlock some new prayers. Oh man, 36 prayer. <laughs> GG, boys. Man, I gotta rush for that. Oh, this is a big one, guys. I just hit a pretty big milestone. Alright, I just finished my third task, and oh my god. I didn't think it would take me so little time to get to such a high prayer. I'm gonna do Hell Giants once again, and I should hopefully get uh, maybe two tasks of this, and I can get 43. Yes, the fourth insult head gave me 40 per easy game. Oh, okay. Battlefront teleport. Yeah, we got the runes this time, so. Yeah, now we're talking. Not a bad way to get to the Slayer Master, but damn, I needed to get some more law runes, dude. Oh, there we go. This is it, 44 prayer. Awesome, I, I even got ego eye with that as well. Sick, nice, nice, dude. All right, I'm gonna take a small break from uh, combat training here because I'm gonna try to get myself a uh, rune scimitar. So the first way to get the rune scimitar I'll try is the gangsters. Oh, there it is, yeah. I found them, I found them. Yeah, they just spawned. There you go, second kill. Oh, gold bar intelligence, nice. Oh, gold bar, yo, that's so good. Nice. So I spent about an hour trying out gangsters, but unfortunately they're so slow and it's too many people competing for the mobs. So actually I'm gonna try a second method. This second method involves a uh, low key place called the Shijian Crypt. Inside there are like high level zombies and skeletons. They hit like 18s. So you gotta be really careful, but I do have prayers so I can find a way to like, you know, figure out how to trap them and do all that good stuff. Because if I kill them, they have about a 1 in 60 chance to drop a rune scimitar. And they only have about 60 HP, so they're one of the best ways to get a rune scimitar. Okay, well let me see if I could maybe uh, snag a fire staff in that case. Oh, easy snag, bro. So I need to buy 10 of these. Okay, that's not bad. I'm still at 34k, so cool. Alright, alright, I got 500 shots. Let's go with that to kill the zombies with. Oh, there it is. Lit candle. Hell yeah, I need this candle before I can go into the Shijin Crypt. 
Alright, okay, so... We're pretty much ready to go, man. Ah, shit, they hit so hard, dude. Come on, Fire Strike, stop hitting ones. You're shitting me. Okay, first kill. But yeah, man, they are kinda Monka S to kill. Yeah, I managed to get the Major stuck, so he's just gonna chill there. I'm, I'm just gonna tag these guys pretty much by themselves. Oh, Hard Clue Scroll, what the fuck? Yo, I might just have to stop everything that I'm doing right now and uh, just do this. Damn, sweet corns are so good right now. Hundred, uh, a pick, and I can now grow some Gala Gala Vanova fruits or whatever in the city farm, Thai farm. I mean, all right, should be it. Please, fit step. Yes. Oh my god, that was so easy, dude. Why are hard clues? Apparently, there's only four steps, and they, they're all doable, because it's wizards and dig spots. I'm pretty sure this is going to be such a good reward, dude. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. d high, bro. Yes. Plate skirt. Oh, the rune monster. It's all good, dude. Yeah, I'm going to use this. I'm going to use this, because um, I don't have a rune skim yet. Oh. oh, wait. 48 laws. Yes. That's also good, too. 48 laws, bro. Man, that means I can uh, fill up my uh, Cardis Memoir and also use my uh, Zaya Teleports. Oh my god, another Hard Clue Scroll? Are you serious? Jesus, man. You get you get them so often or I'm just like really lucky with these Hard Clues? Alright. Let's try this out. So uh, I think I'm going to try to flinch the Mage, uh, the Wizard. I do have some Strange Fruits to uh, cure some Anti-Poison here, so... There we go. Yeah, I know how to do it now. Okay. So the strat's pretty simple now. Now that I figured it out. I go for one hit. I let him uh, hit me with magic twice so I can be off cooldown with my Rulong. And for some reason, if I step back, he just doesn't do anything. So I just repeat that process. So, Oh, the second hard clue, bro. That's what I'm talking about, man. I couldn't do that with medium clues, but I could do this with hard clues, man. Let's go. Alright guys, let's not waste any more time. Here we go. Oh my god, bro! Sir D high boots! Yo, that's lit! That's nice. Oh, I already got the rune long sword though. I can't wear this, can I? 70 range. Let's go, dude. This is nuts. Oh, rune helm. Bro, I just got a best in slot right there. The new best in slot. Hell yeah, brother. Hey, 60 strength. That's awesome, man. So, I have a rune skirt from the first BM crew, and oh my god, this setup looks so good, even though it doesn't look good, but the stats though, man, I gained like 50% extra defense over what I had before. Okay. What? Oh my god, so is he that stupid? Oh wow, he's so stupid. His, <laughs> his pathing is literally that bad, dude. It is out of his range. Yes! Oh, jeez, that was great. Oof, a lot of Michael Jackson moves, but we got it, though. Yes, the third one, but this one was so much harder than the other ones. God damn. Let's do this. They say third time's the charm, so here we go. Oh, shit, boys, what is this? Oh, wait, it's a red dehyde, chaps. Ah, uh, I mean, it's not, it's not black dehyde. Come on. I thought this was a zammy dehyde, chap, for a second, dude. Oh, wait, the rune kite? The rune kite though, dude! Yo, I didn't even notice that. Oh, baby. That's hot. Ah. Ah, look at that defense, bro. Oh, wait, the rune plate? I didn't even see the rune plate! Oh my god, dude. That is stacked. Oh my god, dude. I didn't even notice the rune plate, bro. Yo, that's... Ah, oh, that is beautiful. All I need is the rune skim. I can die happy, bro. Holy shit, guys. Twisted League is so freaking fun, dude. I am not even gonna lie, bro. I've been putting in a bit too many hours than I, I ever think I would have on, you know, a limited time mode. But I couldn't get the Rune Skin Guitar, but I'm gonna try to get that tomorrow on the next video. And yeah, we're gonna get some more gains. We're making insane progress towards the Soul Raise attempt. I'm trying to get my first completion as fast as I can. Maybe even be able to compete with Wooks. We shall see. We shall see. 
I also streamed this on Twitch, so if you want to see everything live, because this is a very time-sensitive event, you can do so on twitch.tv slash ricecoat. And my friend chat's always open, so if you guys want to theorycraft your gameplay for Twisted League, or just hang out and ask questions and play some RuneScape, Mr. Iron Bar French chat, always open. Welcome to have you. And also, if you don't want to miss out on the next prize video for the Twisted League, make sure to subscribe and ring the bell, alright? Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.